I'll just get out of the way now. Now loading. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be a recurring thing in this playthrough. Uh, a bit. So you might as well go ahead and start to get out of your system, BSL. So anyway, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'll just say it anyway, boys and girls, children of all ages, <laughs> uh, welcome to the next playthrough of the Game Industrials. Uh, uh, I, I am actually going to be doing X-Blades for this channel. And I have done it before for my channel. Even the LP or leak, so it's time to bring it on here to the game industry. Yeah, I've never. This game's not um, too popular and well known in games, but um, I can say why. <laughs> it's the series is um, it's okay, honestly. They did make another one, uh, Blades of Time. That one was actually really interesting, honestly. It, it was, there was a lot of puzzles to uh, solve in that game, but I never finished it. If I did, I would have actually shown that off too for this channel, but ugh, that game really <laughs> kind of stressed me out a bit, honestly. Oh, yeah, the main protagonist. She kind of reminded me this one anime chick out on an anime show I started watching not too long ago. What's that? I think it's called Lily Prism or some shit like that. Some word I can't pronounce. Lily Sun, okay. It's kind of like Sailor Moon, but different. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, the main character here is uh, Ayumi. She is a uh, treasure hunter. She's basically out looking for valuable treasure, and now that she brought that here, we got this going on. Like, so. I was going to say, right, right now, I was... I want to start getting the one on the PS3, but uh, after watching this, I didn't think I, I ain't angry with it. Eh. It's only been two minutes. Yeah, you I mean, I, I seen I seen I seen gameplays of this before. Because I, I guess came with Ross way back. Yeah, when we uh, first met. <laughs> yeah, when we used a freaking uh, movie maker. Yeah, that he randomly cut out. Piece of crap. No offense. <laughs> <laughs> it was a crease. Of, it was a piece of crap, just like Amp Studio. Yes, it was. Now those two things that put together and kill those enemies make this. We got us this little map here. Leads us to uh, well, something mysterious, and we're gonna be doing that. Uh, well, now. And every time I see the word South Peak. I keep thinking it says South Park. Damn it all, man. <laughs> <laughs> and on the bottom there, I'll tell you some advice. Like to collect souls so I kill monsters or collect an artifacts, but I'll be explaining more about the game shortly. Nice boots. I am a treasure hunter. Oh my god, B. I, I thought you years. said nice boots. I was about to say. So they're up there, but you, some things you can view your ass while you're at it. <laughs> oh, and I always work alone. Why would I want a park? Pervert. <laughs> I'd have to share the loot. About a year ago, but you know, I was just waiting and uh, you, you were gonna look there and say, say, say something like nice ass or something. He <laughs> said nice boots. <laughs> hey, you thought you she said you said nice boots. Yeah. Jeez. Man, what she's talking about, uh, basically. Yeah, she found a man, and she's going to try to find the treasure that this god or whatever left here. It could be something valuable. It could be something dangerous. Yeah, she wants it, though. Oh, yeah, ain't this, ain't this the game we had a Demon Sogre moment? Uh, uh, it was a creator moment, technically. Yeah, <laughs> Seal corrected me. It was actually a creator moment I had. <clears throat> but yeah, uh, basically, she doesn't really like to work with others. She'd rather work alone. She likes working alone and keeping all the treasure and valuables to herself. Um, so I'm actually playing on the PS3 right now. Um, you used oh, that's right. you, you had this on the, uh, on the uh, what can we call it, 360. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't have any more than 360, so I got on PS3, which kind of funny. I actually got for like three bucks at GameStop. I never knew the first F was on the PS3. I knew the second one was on there. Uh, the se the first and second are both on a uh, Xbox 360. Yeah. 
Yeah, Blades of Time is pretty good, and um, it's very time-consuming. <laughs> but it looks really interesting, but if I were to play it again and maybe be able to beat it, I may actually show it all, but we'll get there later. But right now, uh, basically, we're kind of going through a, I guess you could say a bit of a tutorial on learn the basics of this game. So, uh, I guess I'll explain all the stuff here. You got the green bar there for health. Uh, the red bar there below is your rage. Um, we'll get to that in just a little bit. Basically, right now you see the attack games. I use a square if you're using PS3 to attack. Um, that's the R1 or these R1 or R2 button. You gotta kill these things with that because you can't reach them. Yeah, her her blades are special. They're uh, now you attack them with your swords, so but you can also use they have guns equipped and on it too. So nice little combo. And I honestly do not like the camera on this either. <laughs> me not me neither. The camera is kind of annoying to work with on this on this game. I will not lie. Also, so if I'm not the, mistaken, so does this game has two endings? Yes, and um, uh, the first um, I'll get to that in a little bit. Yeah. But yeah, um, it, there are two endings, but they're very simple to get though. And right there, those are. I don't know all the enemies' names here, but I know I believe those are like scarabs or something. Not the scarabs that we know of, but um, they're some demon type of scarabs, I would just guess. But yeah, we just learned a new spell called Earthquake. Is just slant Earth slam to the ground and destroy everything. Earthquake. But, uh, also, um, as you said, right now it says you have to find the artifacts. Also, another thing you want to do is destroy everything around you to collect more souls. The more souls you get, the more stuff, new skills you'll be able to learn, which uh, will help you along the way in the game. So, it'd be very useful to have it. Also, you saw earlier when she was actually charging up uh, red. If you hold down the button on what spell you want to use, um, it'll, it'll cost that much to use that uh, particular spell. So that's another way to do it. Or use restore one of those crystals to uh, charge your rage up completely like that one right there. Because we're about to fight a uh, fight a new enemy here in just a second. <clears throat> yeah. Once she uh, once it pops up. Oh yeah, I didn't get it yet. Can you believe summer's almost over already? Yeah, some people are going back to school and such. Oh man. That sucks. Even though I don't go to school no more, it still sucks. <laughs> yeah, I finished college uh, last year. <laughs> <laughs> also, this is a ice elemental. Obviously, the only way to kill it is with uh, fireballs. Fireballs are yum. Not so yum. <laughs> well, we can use them against them, sir. It, this one's good. <laughs> oh yeah, I know the type right there is your uh, how many how much souls you have right now. You've collected, by the way. Along the way, it will multiply later on, so you'll be able to collect more and more. Like a certain achievement where you have, like, like maybe like one million souls or something, or one billion souls. So you can get as many as you want. Because a lot of souls later on are going to cost a lot. And the gun in the center of where that comp... Uh, I guess you can call it a compass or a watch on the bottom left. Uh, you'll be learning new gun, gun abilities, too. Not to like you're uh, halfway through the game though. Also, we're also so. How long is this? So how long is this game? Um, I think this will only take maybe a couple hours to beat. Not too yeah. long, I would say. Yeah, because I can't remember how long this game. Because it's been a while since I watched you play this game. It's not really too long to take a couple hours to beat if you know what you're doing. Yeah, and but... you did it again for the LP or League. <laughs> Now, that uh, silver artifact we collected, while this cutscene's going, uh, there are silver, ruby, and gold artifacts. If you collect three of them, you're up your uh, melee gun or uh, melee item and air, air abilities will uh, increase by uh, a level. You can max out to level three. Also, new character coming in. Who the hell is that? Uh, that is the light. It's a pants on. 
Seriously? Yeah. Yeah, she has, she, she has a thong on. <laughs> I'm just listening on that one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're a no carbon, but yeah. He's a, he is a light god, though, so he's been guarded this treasure. And he's trying to guard it from humans or anyone else, so I'm taking it. And she's going to be stupid and touch it anyway, because she's just stubborn. Oh, god damn it. Here's what happens when you don't listen, Ayumi. This is the punishment you get now. <laughs> just like Sonic Gloss for would tell us, try to tell him not to kick that freaking uh, horn that Aven was slow, but he kicked it anyway. <laughs> so, uh, boss fight time. And we aren't technically going to win this fight. We will win, but we're not going to technically win overall. Uh, don't you just hate those type of moments where and, you're forced to lose to a boss? And it'll tell you a tip on how to beat him. We only we only use fireballs against this uh, against the light. So just get this or charge him up and just keep blasting at the light as much as you can. Simple enough. You don't want to get mauled to death by the other, other demons here. <laughs> But yeah, simply just defeat him, and oh yeah, the bomb right is uh, his health. So just deplete that down, and then uh, uh, you'll be done. Simple enough. Uh, is everyone still there? Yeah, I'm, I'm here. Okay. <laughs> just want to make sure you're okay. All right, and uh, well, almost. Damn it. Wed. No nope, more. Win. Oh, there you go. All right, won the battle, but like I said, we're not gonna win. Those eyes. It's the curse. And what year this game came out? Uh, two thousand five or six, I think. Wow. Oh my god, I was. I had just graduated at that time. <laughs> a, like a year after. Wait, this came out two thousand five. I 2005 or 6. I graduated in 2005. Let me grab the case real quick. I swear it would be later than that, because I think the PS3 came out in 2006. I'm trying to look at the case here to see if I can find the... The Sun Temple. That sounds that sound like a Zelda Temple. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, 2009, this came out. Yeah. That is yeah, quite that... a difference. Yeah, that's, yeah. A, that's a big difference. <laughs> anyway... Yeah, this is this is just a dream. This isn't real. Oh, we're in the Matrix. Where's the weapons? Where's the guns? Lots of guns. You have many options. <laughs> the red butt, or was it the red pill, the blue pill? The yeah, the the red pill and the blue pill. Okay. And then this again. Uh, yeah, you have to fix that. Okay, <laughs> it's gone out. <laughs> Nope, it's not now. It's worse. Now you must fight your own shadow. No. Oh, you've already. Oh, go ahead. Did you get Splatoon yet? Did no. you get Splatoon yet? No, I have not. <laughs> well, no, I'm but... smash both with the Wii U. No. When I get a job, I will. She can't. Yeah, you're supposed to get it, but freaking Vita got in the way. Hey, that's too I can't help it. <laughs> I'm still working on Rebirth 3, damn it. <laughs> I, got like I blame one, you, Vita. I got, like, one more trophy left to get Platinum. Oh, you, you about to pass me a Platinum. I just now notice. Because <laughs> I have seven of them. <laughs> it's all because of all, the, all of them are Neptunia. <laughs> I, I, won't be, I won't be able to get the next Platinum until next month. And that's from Life is Strange Episode 5. <laughs> Oh yeah, triple subits, by the way. <laughs> and because of this curse, this is gonna happen now. You about to pass me a platinum bastard. This damn thing comes out. <laughs> you can't fight that dark thing until much later on in the game. Right now, this thing just summons out more demons to fight. Also, those oh. also the green crystals are uh, basically your health. 
Yeah, you can use the guns here to shoot these enemies or use Earthquake to uh, kill the enemies some more. That's pretty much all I'm going to be doing right now, is just killing these enemies. But there are um, there are artifacts to collect here as well. We'll be getting that after, after we finish the level here. Also, sometimes you can go back to levels that you already finished if you need to uh, grind for more souls. Instead of saying level complete, you'll just say area com area clear. So you can come back if you ever need to just uh, grind for souls. But it's optional, technically. Sometimes you'll need weapons that will be required to take on certain bosses, or uh, you just need something to collect uh, for along the way. So it'll be useful. I see. Yeah. Also, um, that curse I've been mentioning about, um, well, we're going to talk more about it in just a minute once I've learned the new skill for it. But right now, uh, next phase of the fight, uh, the level, and we're going to be introduced to, to new enemies again. I believe these are like some very strange dragonflies or whatever. They're very, they're very creepy and eek. Oh yeah, fun fact. Uh, forgot to mention that favorite Prince episode on Steam now. Yeah, it came out a couple days ago. Yeah, don't uh, really care. August. 7th. I found my PS3 version. August fourth or Australia. What are you gonna say, BSO? I was gonna say kill it with fire. Yes. <laughs> and burn the inferno. <laughs> burn, baby, burn. <laughs> You can burn it or slash it or whatever you want to do. <laughs> or shoot it. Yeah, I love this area called the Infernal and Vangel Tui in Richie World. Oh, gosh. Just shoot it. Oh, oh it's, it's the area where you have to walk on the freaking thick uh, thick floor with the freaking spikes on it. That one. <laughs> oh, that one. I think I know what you're talking about now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. Now they're just well, screwing through for the game of industrials, because all that bad trade you got to do on that game. Oh, uh, Banjo Tui? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm sure one of us will do it for the for the channel. <laughs> I remember how amazing it was that you managed to be in 50 something parts. <laughs> oh, brother. And you dare. And, and, and you even. You, you almost 100% at least. Yeah. <laughs> it's, it's the freaking uh, Canary Mary that just killed it. Uh, yeah. And it's just ridiculous, you know, because. Uh, is that button mashing for shit. If you're good at button mashing, then that game, then that one's easy to beat. Uh, but if you're not, then that's just not the one for you. I'm gonna say right now, if you think that's tough, play Metal Gear Solid 4 Guns of Patriots when you go to that microwave part. That one's a lot worse. When you mention microwave, I think about when 5PB uses the microwave on as an attack against his, her enemies. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> just reminding me of that. <laughs> it's so damn funny. I'll use it on trick every time I get the chance. <laughs> Turn up her. I never used Bobby, so yeah. Preferred it back. Oh, uh, I love how Ron said he needs to get neutered. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right here. Um, this, uh, buying a dark magic will actually cause you to actually get the bad ending to the game. Oh, man. So it's obvious what you need to do. To get the good ending, don't buy Dark Magic. But okay. that's why, uh, yeah, it's pretty simple, actually. Just don't buy Dark Magic. That's kind of like uh, Sean tell you in the Power of Curse in a way. You get 20 Dark Magic just for the good ending. Huh. But, um, if you want to get Platinum on this game, uh, you have to buy all the match, all the spells in this game if you want to get it. But, uh, not am, surprised, Nick. <laughs> I'm doing another playthrough on, on another file anyway, where I'm working on it where, without getting dark magic. So, I'm going to try to get the good I'm gonna sh get the good ending on that. I'm going to show both of them instead of playing through this twice. Because that's just a pain to do. Now, is it bad ending? Is it depressing? Uh, it kind of is, yeah. Uh, the, anyone, anyone die? Uh, yeah, but uh, we'll get to that later. Oh, uh, god damn it. Also, sad face. I didn't reach a 200 hit combo. That's actually a trophy you can get in this game if you get 200 hits. 
It is possible. <laughs> so well, I believe on God of War three, there's a choice for for getting a 500 combo. Damn. Yeah, they're in thing like that. I, um, I got it though. <laughs> um, for future recordings, so I will go ahead and say I will be cutting out these parts where I collected uh, any of these unnecessary souls. That one's special right there, the red one. Um, that'll give you more souls compared to these right here. I think it's like a multiplier of maybe like times five or something. I don't remember. Anyway, and the last artifact is over here. The gold one. This one's for uh, melee skills. And All right, part's almost over. Yes, it is. Just destroying whatever's left here before I go on. I don't know what I'm doing here. Just showing. Oh, oh, I was trying to do a move for a uh, for a level later on, but we'll get to that in the next part. X way where we head to the. Uh, I believe it's the stone ruins where we're heading to next. Let me just see real quick. Yep. Well, stone circle. All right. So we'll see you guys in later, folks. Later. Later.